So for today, we're going to be looking at Frosties. This did get asked for not too long ago. And if you guys like the video, like, comment, subscribe, it really does help. Let me know if you guys are interested in any other type of videos. But other than that, let's just get into what this exotic actually does. So for the exotic perk, it is called Rapid Cooldown. Increase grenade, melee, and dodge rate regeneration while sprinting. Dodging increases your sprint speed. So yeah, Frosties is basically Hollow Fire Heart, uh, but you just run instead of having your super. Uh, actually, technically, if we want to be real technical, uh, Hollow Fire Heart is actually still better because you still get a bump even if your super's not up, but then you get an even better uh, regeneration when your super is up. So, I mean, like we have to we have to run, and we do get faster sprint speed when we dodge, so that's cool, I guess. But uh, there's a lot of people who, or I shouldn't say a lot, but there is like a cult of people that use this and they're like they swear up and down by it. it's really good i personally don't use it as much as i used to uh, mostly because i am just a stompy hunter and i just like going fast that being said i probably will start using it again because uh if i remember correctly abilities are getting nerfed and i mean why not like let's just go so that's pretty much what it does i'm not going to talk too much about this because this is a pretty well-known exotic and this is mostly just to showcase what the exotic does, not like an actual proper build. So, yeah, as for how it looks, I think it looks terrible. Uh, I've never, never liked Frosties. I've always thought it looks just like a big piece of dog shit. And it's no different. I, I think the hoses is I um, you know what it is? It's the fact that, like, I get what they're saying. Uh, the hoses are supposed to be coolant or cooling your pants. I get it, but if I'm being honest, there could have been so many cooler ways to do this. Um, hoses just like randomly coming from the top or your waist is just kind of like whatever's. If they really wanted to wow me, they could have done the pipes a lot better. Um, I'm not gonna talk about the whole design because I, I can talk I can talk that for like hours, like legitimately, because I do have like in my head a cooler way they could have designed Stompies. Uh they could have just made it symmetrical and the pipes go all the way down from both sides. They didn't have to do it all weird like they did. But to be fair, Marcus Wren, uh, the, who, the person who made this. Uh, yeah, he he I, actually I was going to say he doesn't make good exotics, but he made stompies as well. And stompies are pretty fucking symmetrical. So I don't know. As for how it shaders, Echoed Anger looks really, really cool with it. Uh, as you guys can see, it takes off the red. Well, not doesn't take off the red, but Echoed Anger already has red. So it just kind of uh, camouflages the already red there. And you just see that those silver lines. I think that's super dope. And if the pipes weren't like asymmetrical, I think it would have been really cool. Honestly, it's just the two pipes on the right leg that kind of like ruin it for me. Abyssinian Gold looks pretty cool with it as well. Uh, thankfully, the red stripe actually does change color. The only unfortunate part is the fact that the rubber soles on the boots don't change color. And for me, that is kind of a big deal, even though for some people it's like, that's so small. Like for me, I see it. And if I see it, it's just going to bug me. So Abyssinian Gold's not too bad, but I do think like, Echoed Anger is probably going to be really cool with it just because you get that really cool silver. And as for the example set, this one is a little weird, but I do think it looks cool, surprisingly. So this is kind of like an amalgamation of the Frosty's ornament video, the, this one right here. Uh, I took pieces of that one, I think specifically like, what was it? The Braytech Combat Vest, I think it was. And uh, I think that's it actually. I just took the vest from that video. And then I put Streetwise grips on it just because I wanted a little bit more casualness to it because uh, the boots are very casual. So I, it's so weird. This one is legitimately a weird one for me because I don't know where my head was going with this one. I just think the chess piece because it's it's from Mars and the Mars set is specifically like a very uh, snow themed look. And the arms, I think I was just going for that because uh, it's casual. Same thing with the boots and then the cloak and the helmet. So the, the Omni Oculus mask is one of my favorite helmets right now because it is one actually it's the only helmet in the game that not only looks like a helmet like something you would wear in a combat situation but it takes your hood off as well we do have two other ones which is the tiger tiger mask which is just a tiger mask i'm not a big fan of it i don't even have it and the uh the casual 
a helmet, which I, I fucking hate that helmet so much just because it looks pretty bad. So when Omni Oculus got it, like when I saw it and it didn't have a hood, I just immediately knew I was going to get it this season because I really needed a helmet that takes the hood off because then I can do something like this with Exodus down cloak, which I think this looks super cool. I kind of imagine my hunter going through like the snow with this one because the cloak has that really cool, like a uh, not hoodie, but like the it's almost like a scar kind of, but not really. It looks super cool. I really, really like it. And it looks really cool with the Braid Tech combat vest specifically because it has that uh, cloth on the, the chest. And if I were to change one thing here, it would probably be just switching out the arms for something a little bit more combat themed. Uh, like specifically the um, the Europa the Europa arms, I think would be a better choice for this, just because those are a little bit more combat uh, themed, and it's uh, thin as well, so it's not gonna look super weird with this. So overall, I really do like this set. Um, I think I said all of this. Yeah, Omni Oculus, Streetwise, Bray Tech. For these shaders, I kind of just went with Regal Daring, just because I really liked how the red and gold looked with it and then i just kind of went in with it i was like fuck it i'll just go with it i'm not really thinking too much on this one and then amrita's dream specifically because i wanted just a pure white and that was a really good white that went with the chest piece as well so with braid tech combat vest this is one that i very much like to combine other cloaks that have like a lot of cloth there so that way it looks like it's connected to it kind of like a poncho and yeah i actually do think this looks hard like i think i think this look is hard i think it looks super cool and there is there is things you can switch out honestly like the the arms and the chest for sure are pieces you can switch in and out with but i think the helmet and the cloak are super dope and if i'm being honest the break tech combat vest really does make this whole set look really cool because of that cloth there so i would actually say just just switch the arms at it's at this point as for the ornament i actually did make a video on this if you guys want to see it's right here we go pretty much what we're going to go through right now but we go through how it looks, how it shaders and the example set, which I did switch out from the one that I'm using because I didn't want to use the same one. But it's also I took it from my Stompies look, which if you guys have seen my Stompies look, you actually my, you actually don't know which one because I have a few Stompies looks. So that's also pretty funny. And I do have a Stompies video for hunters who are like, I want to like a Stompies fashion. I do have the one. I made it a long time ago. It's one of the first videos that I made. If not, I think that's the first exotic video I made. But yeah, if you want to check it out, be, I'll I'll be happy for you to do it because it'll help me with my analytics. But as for 8000er, I love how it looks. I'm I'm not going to change much about my review from the look. It looks fucking cool. I really, really like it. I love pretty much everything. And apparently when you actually use it, it does have some snow effect on it. So that's really, really cool. As for how it shaders, I think it shaders fine um a lot of the colors i'm liking equid anger looks really really cool with it the only thing that i kind of find uh not annoying but i wish it just took shaders differently or colors specifically is the white straps i wish the white straps were like taking either the main color or the off color which actually this is the off color which is white for abyssinian gold i actually think it looks really really cool aside from the greaves again brown just i don't really fuck i don't really ugh, i really don't fuck with that color but everything else looks really really cool uh as for the example set so if you guys have seen my casual stompies look then you guys will immediately notice which which set this is because this is literally my casual stompies look uh for the helmet mechanic 1.2 th that one is not part of my casual stompies look i just wanted to add that one because i like the visor but i usually don't use mechanic 1.2 i use the other green helmet which looks way better uh for the arms we're using the streetwise grips with the street wise vest i think well obviously these two pair together because they are in the same set but i didn't i don't like how the street vest looks with other arms which is why i always pair it with the street wise grips just because both of them just look better together and i can't find any other piece that looks better than this uh obviously 8000 or for the look for the boots and renegade hood for the cloak so this one i really didn't think about it just because i was like i'm just gonna go with something that i think looks super cool and i think this looks super cool i think this looks like you're gonna you're you're out in the snow traversing the the fucking terrain and there's not really much i can say more about this uh if i were to change some few things i would probably just put some uh 
some uh, Europa stuff in there because uh, Europa stuff has a lot of snow themed stuff specifically like if you want to go with the cloak you have like the fur the backpack and some tools as well unfortunately the I think the boots has the best piece for it because the boots have um, like an actual ice pick so that would have been cool but yeah I, I really like this look as well I do think the first look is way better and if I'm being quite honest I think the 8000 video the one that the or the uh example set from there just looks way way better so this one was just more of a like i'm just gonna steal the stompies look because it, it is thematic at least for me it is so that's pretty much it let me know what you guys think this one was not going to be a long video considering it's only one ornament and i already covered that ornament in a previous video and i didn't want to talk too much because again i made a video on that if you guys want to see it check it out i highly suggest it because the example set in that video is a lot better than these two if i'm being quite honest not saying the first one's bad i actually really really like it it's just that uh thematically the the 8000 er look just looks way better because it it actually makes sense so let me know what you guys think i appreciate you guys uh watching these videos i really do the analytics are looking fucking great and i really really need to start making some of these videos because i'm sitting on a lot of content specifically on my second channel because if you guys don't know i have a second channel it's called fix tony plays that's where we play everything. I'm I'm currently going through Dead Space Remake. Uh, the series is going through. I already beat it, but I haven't posted all of it yet because I'm a fucking lazy piece of shit. But I have it all rendered. I have it all done. And I'm just going to actually after this, I'm going to be posting everything right now. So I have a lot of content that I'm just sitting on that I will be posting within this week. So expect a lot of content from me, especially on my second channel. But even on the main channel, I have three to four videos that I'm sitting on right now. Uh, not including this one and we have some of the assassin's creed armor pieces that i am still working on as well so let me know what you guys think be safe and i'll see you guys later